Hi guys, welcome and welcome back if you are new. Um, so today we've got a bit of a uh, fun one to do. So I've been looking at my budget quite a bit. Um, my college has agreed to get me tested for Discalcula because honestly, with regards to my maths, even when I'm doing my budget and things like that, it is completely wrong so whoever watched my last video thank you because honestly it made no sense whatsoever um i don't know how i did the maths for that um i have got here 840 pounds plus an additional 25 um from something that i sold this morning but look at that five pound note well i had to check that this was real because <laughs> it's just is that nice this is Pebbles, by the way. She decided to join me today. Um, so 25 was from some shelving that I um, sold this morning. But all of this was spat out of the machine. Now listen, I had to go to the cash point outside my local Tesco and get, like, I think it was like three lots of 250 and then another £90, I believe it was, because I just needed £840. But this is how it's all come out and I completely forgot about it because I got it out quite late last night. So bear with me while I turn these notes around. And as usual, I do not have any £5 notes. So, I don't know how this is going to go today at all. Perfect. So, I need to spread this money over five weeks. So, let's just count this. So, it's 2, 4, 6, 8, 100. Two, four, six, eight, two hundred, six, eight, three hundred, two, four, six, eight, four hundred, two, four, six, eight, five hundred, six, eight, six hundred, two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, so seven hundred, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety. 800, 10, 20, 30, 40. 10 pound is from my daughter pay me back for the McDonald's that she had at 11 o'clock last night. And then 25 from this morning's shelving sales. Pebbles, I'm going to have to move you. You're so chilled though, aren't you? <laughs> um, so... I need to split this into five days. I'm going to take the 25 and put it to one side um, and a 10 to one side. So this is 840. Um, so I think it was, I'll put my calculator down somewhere. I think it was 160 odd something, but I'm going to put 160 and then whatever's left, I'm going to put in week five. Two, four, six, eight, one hundred, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty. Now I haven't left a buffer in my bank because what I'd normally do, because I hate change, is I would um basically buy an extra item so that I would then use my card for the uh, like the little leftover change bit so that I wouldn't get any cash back uh, change back rather so I've decided to stop doing that because that one item then became two or three extra items and then 
at which point it would then become like an additional like 30 or 40 pounds and then I'd overspend on my card. So now I'm going to be incredibly strict with what I spend on this. Um, I'm not going to be touching my card whatsoever. So two, four, six, eight, ten. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Did I put 60 in that or 50? Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, yeah. 40, 50, 60, 80, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and 60. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 20, 40, 60. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 20, 40, and 60. So I've got an additional 40 pounds. Oh, what did I do that for? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 20, 40, 60. Okay. So this is going to be my week five. And what I'm going to do with week five is hopefully swap out some of the change. So week five has got a little bit more in it. It's got 200 in that. Week four has got 160. I'm hoping to change out some 20s for fives as we go along. Week two, and we are going to stuff week one. I really do need some fives. Um, I don't know what to do because I really don't have any fives. I also have some leftover change from last month because, as I say, I was using my card until I couldn't. So I've got some pounds, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine pounds in pound coins. And then 50, 70, 90, 1 pound, 40, 50, 60, 7. It's 167. Cool. I need to find some fibres. I might have to pop across the road real quick. Hold on. Okay, I think I've worked it out. We shall see. So, with this change, I don't start college now until September, but I just want to get a little bit sorted before then. Um, so I'm going to leave college, but the canteen, I'm just going to put five pounds in. I don't know, uh, I want to do pound coins actually. That's three, four, five. Hope everyone's doing well, by the way. Like, I'm so nervous today because I'm trying to really focus on my budget that I forgot to say hi. <laughs> um, class supplies and emergency is going to wait until next month. Okay. So, my food this week is only going to get £20. Now, my food is, um, for me... Um, because where my daughter is home educated, she gets a small budget that she basically needs to figure out for herself with regards to food. Um, if there's any clothes that she wants, if there's any beauty products, I'm just trying to get her more financially aware than what I was at her age. Um, because I really, really so badly want my own home, but with the way that things are, I just don't see it happening in 
like the foreseeable future because I'm just absolutely rubbish at money. And I don't want that for her. I want her to be able to, you know, be free with her money but wise at the same time. So Pets is going to get 20. Miscellaneous is getting nothing, dining out. Entertainment, hair and beauty is going to get 20. I'm going off script, which I didn't want to do because I just, I need to get some fibers. Um, shopping, I am doing 30. So this is for me to get some new shoes, some new clothes, but I'm going to do as of this. So, my seasons challenge. So, we've got 20 in there at the moment. Um, this is the one that I was going to do because it's already slightly scratched. I'm a bit worried this is going to be £20 because otherwise I'm not going to have anything to spend. Oh, £10. Okay. That I'm okay with. Um, so the reason why I'm doing this one is because I need one or two things before I go back to college. And I'm hoping that this challenge will be finished before September. Now, again, my maths is shockingly rubbish, so I have most definitely worked that out wrong. Um, oh, I'll scratch that off later. It's so fun, though. It's me saying I'll scratch it off later, and then I'll just carry on. Yep. Okay, £10 is going into this. Whoops, where is it? Nope. <laughs> there it is. So we now have £30 in here. There we go. Um, And whilst we've got this one here, I'm going to put £10 into chocolate. Now, I am a little bit behind with this by about, I think, 20 or £30. I think we're like week 29 now, aren't we? I would shoo my cat off, but she's um, very rarely sits this close to me, so I am enjoying every second of it. Whoops. Okay, so that's that binder done. Let me just put my spending into here. And if I don't spend my spending, it will go towards a car maintenance or something like that just because um, my car is due for a service a full service in September and the last time I spoke to them there was a couple of things that were due for my car so um, car tax all oh, my car stuff now okay um, we're getting rid of this tracker because I am currently doing a new one. Um, so car tax is getting 10. Oh no, I broke it. Ugh. Okay, car service is getting, well, supposed to be getting 25. I did use some of this last month, unfortunately, but... I'll just give it 20 this time around. Two, three, four, five, six, 70 pounds in there now. 
Um, yeah, so last month I had a hundred in here and I didn't calculate as usual and I spent it. MOT is getting nothing, car insurance is only getting 10. Okie doke. So that means I have got an extra £20. Car service was supposed to be going in 25 I don't have, I'll tell you what, car service, five, so that's 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 in service. And what I'm going to do is that five pounds I'm going to put into food because it is incredibly grotty. And when I get grotty notes like that, I always worry that they're not real. So I'm going to add that five. So we now have 25 in food. And I am going to put 20 pounds into dining out actually, because me and my college friends and teachers, because um, we're all qualified now, we're gonna go for um a meal together so that'll be my part um shopping i'm gonna pop some change into here so this will be my little bit of buffer and if i go over my buffer buffer rather it'll have to go back into back onto the shelf okay so I've got my little bit of change and then with my last 20 what's I gonna do with that food pets I'll put a 10 in miscellaneous just in case I am yet again forgetting something, which I probably am. This is my daily binder that is ready to go. And then I'm going to put £10 towards the next section of my debt. So this one I need to save up another £40 and then that one will be done. Oh, that was actually traumatising, wasn't it, Pebbles, huh? Look at all that fluff coming off. Well, thank you very much for watching again. That was, once again, an absolute catastrophe, however you say it. Um, thank you for watching if you managed to watch to the end please leave a thumbs up and I will see you next Monday um, in the next video bye